Hi, everybody. Thank you for joining me for this Friday with Father Ron. It's another glorious day here on the shores of Lake Erie. We are so blessed to have our beautiful uh, parish community. Uh, last evening, um, our friends at um, North Coast Design Build, they uh, are, have a pressure both at here at St. Joseph and at Holy Trinity. They um, hosted, paid for um, on the second clam bake steak roast that was here on our beautiful property. And then the proceeds go to uh, CYO. So um, people from um, both Avon and Avon Lake joined us. It's, you know, always, again, a joy to bring people onto our um, beautiful parish grounds um, to, you know, really celebrate the work of our CYO program um, and all the good that it does and the, the needed support um, that this uh, fundraiser offers. So uh, thank you to Mike and Justin, the um, owners of North Coast Design Build for all of your efforts and all the people that um, purchased tickets. And um, again, 100% of the ticket sale goes to um, CYO. So it's divided amongst the two um, programs based on um, you know what, what you filled out when you ordered your tickets. So and from what I understand, uh, this year it's um, pretty much even 50-50, just like it was last year. So tonight <clears throat> we're having our uh, wine and food pairing in the tent. And then Saturday we are having our um, smoked and stirred, which is a, a bourbon and barbecue cigar event. <clears throat> there are still, um, you can still register for that. We, uh, we can take up to 100 people. I think there were 74 people registered. Uh, this morning on Friday, um, and the reservations are closed for um, this evening. So, you know, you can always walk up and see if there's any more space available. But um, but if you'd like to come to the other event on Saturday, the Bourbon and Barbecue, you are certainly welcome to do so. So this weekend, um, I do this uh, not every year, but um, um, I have done it in the past where the preaching, I have all the masses this weekend, I'm going to just be um, preaching about all the spiritual activities that are coming up this year um, um, at our parish and school. So, um, but the first one that's on the list, and you'll have this list in the pews with you, so you can go over it, and I can hopefully bring some clarity and some excitement to some of these things uh, for you. And I'm going to uh, share my my screen here with you, so you can see the advertisement. Right, I think that you can see that now is called um, recognizing the gift. So it is a <clears throat> um, an event where we can sure what's, what's happening there. There we go. Um, it is an event um, for people who are um, dating. It could be for somebody who's um, beginning looking for a spouse, engaged couples. It could be for married couples. Um, so one of the things the Holy Fathers asked us to consider is um, making sure we're aware that it's not just the marriage preparation just around engagement that is necessary to continue to form couples into this beautiful sacrament. That we should start earlier, junior high, high school, letting people know um, the importance of um, sacred relationships, having some sense of um, chastity, that we're made for a purpose, that God uh, has given us our beautiful bodies and they need to be um, honored as a sacred gift, not given away um, for someone's pleasure. So um, if you are, you know, somebody that has a junior high or high school student and you continue to share your beautiful faith with your kids, I know those can, um, those kinds of conversations can be um, perhaps difficult um, or even a little bit uncomfortable but it's really, really important. Um, so this recognizing the gift um, is, is gonna be a very informal um, date night experience. So it is uh, with our cluster parishes of Avon, Avon Lake and Bay Village. It's being, um, we're gonna have it at Parker. So it's not at it's any, any one parish, but um, some place that's in between each of them. And um, it's $15 which will um, provide, you know, some snacks, some food, and then um, then it's an open bar. So 
you can uh, come with any of those people um, if you've been married for a short time or a long time. Um, and again, maybe you have kids um, coming into uh, uh, dating age or you yourself are a young adult looking for a spouse. Um, so there are certainly uh, many people that could really benefit um, from this talk. It's um, by Jen Ricard, who is a nationally known speaker. There is an organization in the Diocese of Cleveland called um, Theology of the Body Cleveland. Um, Theology of the Body was um, certainly been, it's been part of our church tradition for um, hundreds of years, but certainly popularized by now St. John Paul II, really that each of us is made for a purpose and um, our bodies reveal um, the purpose for which God has made them. So it's, it's a uh, just a beautiful expression of um, who we are as children of God and whose we are. So really encourage you um, to come. The uh, marriage and family office <clears throat> just sent out an email and I asked uh, Mr. Greckel, who's our kind of trained theology of the body um, staff member, they have some video resources, um, which we'll preview, but um, I'm sure the diocese has already previewed them, but, uh, and then we'll provide some links so that um, maybe you, even if you can't come, you can watch them, but I, I certainly would encourage you to um, come to this event. So it's $15, you can register um, by going online. This, this registration is under events. Um, you can see it there. These, uh, these events will soon fall off here of the Northern Lights, but it's at the bottom of this page right now. And um, so I just encourage you to, to register. And then um, again, as part of my homily, that's first on the list, but there's some other beautiful opportunities um, coming um, to our parish. So again, thank you so much for all you do uh, for our parish and our community. People love being here. And um, it's just a, a very sacred, holy place to be. And it's because of all of you. So uh, know my love and care for each of you and your families and how much I love being your pastor. And let's pray together. Glory be to the Father and to the Son and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. Uh, enjoy this beautiful weekend. God bless you.